Hello everybody, Yannick Chauvin once again on a little quickie tutorial today. Um, it's quite simple and I've had a few requests uh, for this, so um, let's go right to it. So what we're going to be doing is darkening our sky, our lovely blue sky, as if we've had a, either a circular polarizer or a, a graduated neutral density filter on our on our lens, um, but we'll do it the Photoshop way and it's really, really, really simple to do. Now here's a lovely photo of a house uh, that I took in uh, Bleu Lavande, which is a, a place where you can go and see tons and tons of lavender fields uh, here in Quebec. Uh, it's gorgeous, it smells great, um, and I thought the house looks, looked uh, pretty cool as well, so I, I snapped a shot of it. Now, of course, um, wanting to darken the sky up a little bit, what we need to do first is to create a new layer. Now, I'll bring my layers palette over for you for you guys to see and down here you have the icon to create a new layer. We'll click on that and you have your blank layer that appears here. Um, I always suggest that we we rename our layers and I'll call this uh, Dark Sky. There we go. And the next thing we want to do is to create our dark sky. So let's go for it. You'll see it's really simple. I'll move this out of the way. What you need to do is make sure that your foreground color here is black um, and uh, then you want to select the gradient tool. Make sure your uh, gradient tool is selected on linear gradient which is the first icon here uh, and also make sure that it goes from black to transparent which is usually the second icon. Not black to white but black to transparent. That's really important. All right. Now we're going to draw a vertical line down uh, about here to the house, as, as vertical as you can. And we'll let go. And there we go. And you're going to say, yeah, Nick, ugh, our sky is all black. What are we going to do? Well, this is when the, the trick comes in. Uh, let me bring my layers palette back in here a second. And you can see the blending mode of this layer is, is at normal. Uh, clicking on that, you get a menu that appears. And what you need to select is Overlay. Now you select that, and you can see that the sky turned incredibly blue and incredibly dark, and maybe that's the effect you want. But what's great about that is you can play with that effect and have complete control over how dark you want your sky by reducing the opacity of the layer. As you can see, as I reduce the opacity, the sky is lighting up a little bit or darkening it. So if I'm going at around oh, 50%, 49%, yeah, that's about right for what I want for the feel of this. Oops. And I'll move that out of the way. And there we go. Let's look at before and after. Before and after. It was that simple. So once again, black to transparent gradient, changing your layer mode to overlay, and then playing with the opacity. Thank you, and talk to you soon. Bye-bye.